Hello, I'm Nethi Muthugala, an undergraduate of Tiangong University, China. I'm studying Automation and Artificial Intelligence. Last year, my university, university students, uh, including myself, were took part in a uh, contest in a hackathon called NASA Space Apps 2020. And it was organized by NASA along with the said Sri Lanka and the American Center. In each and every team, there were six members and the challenge that we were focused on was developing or uh, designing a new docking system. Um, I mean, uh, like we were, we worked so hard as a team in our during our very final week, and uh, uh, all the planning, creative stuffs, and the ideas, everything were brainstormed in this place, China Lanka Education Center. And we should be very much thankful for the people, the staff at China Lanka, because they were the one, they were the people who encouraged us, guided us and motivated us to take part in these hackathons and you know uh, hackathons projects and uh, actually one of their uh, one of their objectives was uh, to uh, to do researches and to do impactful projects in China Lanka with our students who are studying in Chinese universities to do something impactful to our motherland because uh, because uh, the students who are learning in Chinese, studying in Chinese universities, they are getting different exposure and di different environment, different education when it comes to our people. And I believe that the experience that they gain from the country China is really important because I mean, in all the aspects, almost all the aspects, like the technological aspects, aspect and the economic and everything, like they get a different aspect and the the difference between the two states are so big and uh, as a result i believe that the students who are coming to sri lanka back after completing the china uh, the, their high studies in china they can do more because they have seen it uh, they have seen it and witnessed it in a in a very much de developed country so i believe they can if they tried more and if we encourage them to do more they will do a lot more than the students who are uh, who have uh, gone to our government universities, and they would they will do much more to our country because uh, they because they have witnessed almost everything, and they they know the difference and they know what we can do as a country to um, come to the developed stage from the developing stage because still we are considered as a developing country amidst all of the uh, all of the above stories uh, fortunately and luckily our project uh, was selected as a global uh, we received a global nomination honorable nomination out of all the other uh, uh, project project ideas because uh, our idea was specially designed with the with the with the help of these six amazing brains uh, who are studying in Chinese university because we know how the real world goes I mean we know how the real world technology uh, works so I mean with the help of that and with the help of you know normal natural stuffs which are happening around us we could uh, plan and brainstorm our ideas and develop a very successful project pitch and it's 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 a huge it's a huge story for us as a as a small team and as well as as a country because uh, i mean in, among all the 180 plus countries in the world this small country, this small island in the Indian Ocean was able to get that honorable nomination for the first time in all the uh, nine years. And this was our first time as a hackath as a country which was uh, conducted this hackathon uh, under the name NASA. So it's a huge thing and it's, it's a huge leap for us as, uh, as teenage uh, university students.